I'm Steve, I'm Ryan, and I'm Adam, and this is Yorkshire Car Restoration. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to Yorkshire Car Restoration. My name is Brian, this one's that's Steve. Hi dude. And this one's brother Adam. How are we doing? And we are going to be showcasing various different classic car restorations that we're going to be doing. And we've also got an abundance of MX-5. Yep, we'll be starting with the Suzuki 1980 LJ80. Um, we'll be moving on to all the bodywork, all the fabrication. Uh, we'll clean up of the chassis because the chassis on this car is very good. So this is a budget restoration, as will all the rest of them because they're made out of sheet steel. Budget tools, nothing fancy. Um, we'll be, as we say, we'll be starting with the Suzuki for fabrication, then we'll be moving on to the paper. As well as that, we've got. What else have we got? <laughs> <laughs> as well as that, we've also got a Mazda RX7 FD, uh, we've got a Mazda RX7 FB, we've also got a Honda S800 from the 1960s, and a Mazda RX4 from the 1970s. I forgot what we're doing there. So with all that, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showcasing the Suzuki first. So this is the first project that we're going to start on. So we'll, uh, we'll get a little bit of uh, footage on the Suzuki and then we'll show you the process of restoring it. So catch you later guys. Also, how many times can you bang on the bonnet before it fades? <laughs> Suzuki LJ80. We're going to start on the 1980 Suzuki LJ80. Metal work, fabrication, chassis cleanup, paint work, and we're going to take you all the way through those processes. Starting with this 90, don't I can't get first thing right. Starting with the 1980 Suzuki LJ80. Um, as you can see, various, well, lots of rust all over. Uh, we've got the bottom, we've got just about every single panel to repair, including the bottom of these doors. Uh, there's actually no bottom of the doors on the inside. Uh, the sill sections. We've got the wheel arch, we have to replace this whole wheel arch section right up to here. We'll also be prepping this panel as well when we, well, you know, all the box sections that are in here, that'll be done. As you can see inside here, we've got all this section here, for various um, welds from previous owners. Uh, we'll be starting with this section, this is the first section we'll be showcasing. It wants to look a little bit closer to this section here that we've already started. As you can see, moving a little bit further around, again, there's no bottom of this door. Again, we've done this section here. We've, uh, this, uh, this is just for attaching the valance, lower valance here. We've got the wheel arch section. We've already replaced as well as all the box sections. Um, the inner, the outer, and the lower sill section, the floor section, as well as all the supporting braces. Um, We'll be showcasing again the first section just in that far corner uh, and moving around the car. Okay, so the guy that sold me the car told me the doors were solid. And the sills may need a little work.
So, the seating position at the moment is a little low and the gear sticks a little high. From Right, you better tune in next time. What was that, Wick? Thank you very much for watching. Okay, cheers for watching. Uh, <laughs> you, I don't know which one to say now. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I don't know, you say it. <laughs> right, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you. What am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> so that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. This is episode one of many. Leave us a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and also find us on Instagram Yorkshire Car Restoration <coughs> I was unprepared for that <laughs> That's, these... Won't be recording Four wheel drive